Hey, what's going on everybody? Uh, this is Craig and uh, I just wanted to do another quick little mail and pickup video. I just did one a couple days ago. Uh, there was something that I had forgotten and then I re received a little bit more in the mail and then I got probably the best mail I've got uh, fan not fan package fan anyone who watches my channel is bored but uh, I got like the best package from one of my friends in the card community and we'll go over that in just a minute here uh, so first first back before all this nonsense started I went to an outdoor flea market and uh, I picked up a couple baseballs and I just forgot about these because I put them in the boys room and uh, just threw them in there that says official major league baseball by Rob Manfred, but this is not, this is soft, so this is just like a a photo ball or just to get an autograph. And then the other one's a Corey Seager one. I think I paid $2 for one and $3 for the other. Completely forgot about those. I just wanted to uh, include those there. And then just a couple days ago in the mail, I got a couple Sandbergs. So these two were in the same lot, the same card, they're serial numbered. I don't know where the three dollar price tag is from. I'm sorry, I'm turning the wrong way here. Nope, I turned it the wrong guy dang way again. So take my word for it, it's a serial numbered card. Uh, I'm trying to find oh there it is. 243 out of 449, and then the exact same card, number eleven out of 449. So a couple Sandberg cards, just a couple bucks plus shipping. And then uh, I was getting another Lofton, trying to get my Lofton collection complete. And this is a score impact player, but I bought the set. So the set came with the immortal Andy Moto, Gary Cooper, the old Texas cowboy actor, probably not. And then Jeff, uh, the other ones in here that I will need eventually would be Jeff Bagwell and BGO. So that's cool. Uh, once again, that was pretty cheap. I just got that for a couple bucks. One of those uh, mass produced sets around the 90s. But the reason I'm doing this video is because I just got a really awesome package in the mail from my buddy uh, Classic Cards, Eric. Uh, most of you know who Eric is. He has probably the most underrated channel on YouTube. Great content every day. He opens a ton of really good stuff a lot of good series So the theme of this mail going forward is classic cards so we have a classic car Alexa play classic music Sure, here's a station you might like ultimate classical on Amazon music We have classic music doing the conductor thing it doesn't probably look like a conductor thing with some ballpoint pens but we got classic car we got classic music now we'll get to the stuff from classic cards so he sent me a nice little um little filler in one of the packs craig b little note hashtag card community and then just a note thank you for the wonderful package uh, that i sent him this is just something small it's not small Eric, it's way too much. And just to prove that this is a mailing envelope that he sent me, he sent me some awesome stuff. We got a Mark Grace. I did not have that one. I'm just going to go over the Graces first, real quick here. Actually, there's one more. And this is probably my favorite card of, that he sent me. This is awesome. This is the uh, Tops Allegiance. It's like the, uh, the finest look. Mark Grace. That's awesome. He sent me some Sandbergs. And then he sent me two Sandberg rookies. Dude, you don't have to do that. He sent me the Fleer Sandberg rookie. Other than just being a little off center, which I don't care, this card is in perfect condition. I love this card. Thanks, man. This is a Sandberg Fleer rookie. And then he also sent me the, the Sandberg Donruss rookie. And this one's um, hair off on the centering, as you can see. But once again, other than that, the card is in immaculate, perfect condition. And uh, other than my favorite grader of GMA, I really don't, uh, really don't use the grading service. He also sent me some other Sandbergs. I did not have the tops fire. I really haven't got much starting from last year for Sandbergs. 
I don't think I had this card right here. Upper deck. Another Sandburn. I don't know if I had this card or not. I'll have to look. It's uh, Studio. And then this other Studio, which is a really cool card. So, he also sent some other stuff. Wow, Eric, man, you, you went above and beyond. I can't wait to get some more stuff together for you and send it off soon. He sent me a bunch of packs that we're going to take a look here. Let's move the car real quick. We have 89 tops. We have a 93 Series 2 Stadium Club. One of my favorite uh, sets of all time, 88 uh, Fleer. I love the 87, 88, and 89 Fleer. Amazing. I was looking at these Holiday Inn Cal Ripken cards online a couple months ago. I was going to buy some because I saw them on, uh, I think, Past is a Live show. And then I was going to send a pack or two to Corey. And then someone, I think, bought them or outbid me. But we have that. And then he also sent me Upper Deck 1995 SP. So this is really cool. So let's open a couple of these packs real quick. Open the cow. I, I got to get that cow where he's holding the pillow. It looks like he's uh, going to smother his wife. But then she wakes up and he just got that smile on his face like he was just messing around. Oh, there he is holding the uh, Priority Club's reward card. Thanks, Cal. Little insert. Visit the Ultimate Site for Baseball Cards. We have a Ricky Weeks. Ricky Weeks was a nice player. Same with Carlos Delgado. And then also everyone's favorite, A-Rod. So the A-Rod card's cool. I'll have to continue my search for the Cal Ripken pillow card. Let's do the SP here. Some really nice classical music. I usually have on like Rump Shaker or something from the 90s. Some old school rap, but ooh, look at this. We have a Mike Schmidt SP die cut card. That is beautiful. I don't remember ever having bought these cards before, so this is really cool for me to see these. And I'm pretty sure that Classic is doing his pack plunge, and a lot of these packs he's doing in the in the pack plunge, so everyone should check that out and watch him open all these and a bunch more of these packs. Jose Valentin, Rafi Palmiro, Alex Gonzalez, We have, oh, Piazza. I always get good Piazza cards when people send me packs, so I do breaks. Ooh, look at this. It's an Ozzy Smith. It's different color on the side there. That's shiny. That is awesome. I don't really collect Ozzy Smiths. I kind of put them in my common pile, other than like the special ones. I'll actually keep that one. And then we have Ken Hill. Trying to think of something witty to say about Ken Hill, but I just can't. So let's do this uh, 88 Fleer real quick here. John Franco. Jose Nunez. Rob Malicote. Trying to get this to... Who the hell is Rob Malicote? He's seen some things in his life. He's lived, a, he's lived a rough life. Floyd Bannister, Jerry Mumphrey, Dale, the Murph, Dale Murphy. Chet Lemon, our friend that we haven't seen for a while, or I haven't seen for a while. And Tony Phillips. Let's just do this 89 pack real quick. Appreciate you guys uh, coming in so I can show you the awesome stuff that Eric sent me. We got the gum card of Ron Guidry. I don't believe in taking the gum off the card. I think that's where it was meant to be, and it's going to stay on the card forever. And events like Von Hayes, a lot of people ripping Von Hayes. Danny Tartable. Hey, George Brett, that's a cool card. I'll throw that in the uh, old PC of cards I have for Brett. Eric Davis. Larry Sheets, and then Tony LaRusso. And one last pack. This is the Stadium Club, the best photography in cards. We'll start off with Shane Mack. These aren't really bricking at all either. Actually, I really like these. I like the, uh, the red and the gold 
combination there together. Well, Jose Canseco is on the Rangers. Just doesn't look right in a Rangers card. We have an info card. What? Okay, I don't know. Info card. Second City Slugger, Sandberg's on there. I'll actually keep that since it has Sandberg's name on there. Look at that. That's a cool Luis Gonzalez. I don't know if that's a rookie or not. I'll have to look into that. Devon White, Brian Hunter, and Mark Guthrie. So once again, uh, awesome. Thank you, Eric. Uh, thank you, anybody who takes a couple minutes to watch this. Alexa, stop. Okay. And... Uh, Thanks for watching the video again, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.